With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hi everyone, let's take a question. The question says that the freezing point of 4% aqueous solution of A is, is equal to the freezing point 10% aqueous solution of B. If the molecular mass of A is 60, then the molecular mass of B will be. So here we are given that the freezing point of 4% aqueous A is equal to the freezing point of 10% aqueous B, right? So, if the freezing points are equal, then we can also say that the delta T of A is equal to delta T F of B, right? So, we can also say that, so delta T F is, is equal to K F into i into m okay here in this question we will not consider i why because in the que question there is no mention of the electrolyte so what we will consider we will just consider k f into m and if the freezing points are same and delta t f values are same then the k f will also be same so we will only consider the molality we will only consider the molality so we have the molality of a is equal to the molality of b now we know that the molality formula is weight of solute right weight of solute so it will be w a upon what it will be molar mass of a into thousand upon the solvent involved in the a solution right so let's suppose we have that as W1, okay, is equal to WB into 1000 upon molar mass of B, here suppose 2. So we are given that the A solution is 4% aqueous, A solution is 4% aqueous solution. If it is 4% aqueous, then we can say that it has 4 gram of solute in the 100 grams of solution right so then what will be the solvent solvent will be the 96 gram solvent will be the 96 gram same goes for b so b is 10 percent aqueous okay so if it has it is 10 percent aqueous then it has 10 gram of solute in the 100 gram of solution so what will be the solvent here? 90 grams. Okay. So, from here we have got the value of, this will be our WA, this will be our WB, it will be our, what it will be? It is W2 and it is W1. Okay. And if we talk about the molecular mass of A, it's given in the question. It is 60. It is 60. Right. It is 60 and we have to find the molecular mass of B. So, let's substitute the values. If we substitute the values in the formula, it will be, first it was WA. So, molality of A is equal to molality of B. So, here it will be 4 upon molar, molar mass is 60 into 1000 upon 96. It is W1 is equal to WB. WB is our 10 upon molecular mass we have to calculate into 1000 upon 90 okay let's solve it so if we solve this equation now what we will get after solving it we will get mb is equal to 10 into 1000 into 60 into 96 right upon 4 into 1000 into 90 okay so 1000 will be cancelled out with 1000 right so what we will have 4 will be cancelled out with this as 15 so here it will be 9 
and after solving it we will get the molecular mass of b is equal to 160 gram per mole 160 gram per mole and this is our answer so let's see so it matches with the first option and it is our correct answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today